hello and welcome to perennial gateways in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to save the zip packets of a particular call using Wireshark to do that please open your Wireshark also please open any soft phone which is Zoiper phone in my case please note I am already registered to the SIP provider using their SIP proxy address so I don't have to register that again now go to capture and options start the trace as my interface is wireless network connection I am selecting that and I am starting the trace now as I need only the SIP packets I will filter it using SIP keyword and apply it. Now I will place a call. Sonatel's telephone support is currently now, closed. After a brief Our telephone support no, is open Mondays a brief through Fridays. Time period, I will hang up the call. So once I hanged up, I will go to the invite packet and and I will try to find the call ID of that packet so where I can get it I can get it in the SIP header under the message header go to call ID and then right click on it apply as a filter select it doing that you will only see the call flow of your SIP call now go to capture and stop the trace after stopping the trace, go to the file menu and you will find the export specified packet option. Just click on it and then you need to save the packets by giving some name somewhere in your computer, which is desktop in my case. Now I have saved the zip packets, I will close the Wireshark. I don't have to save it I already saved now I will try to open that particular file which I just save so there you go you have saved all the zip packets corresponding to a particular call using the options in Wireshark why do we need that because some cases you will have a trouble you know having you know audio quality issues in your call or there could be a call connection issues so if you can able to save the packets of your SIP call then you can probably share this packet to the provider or anyone who is trying to troubleshoot your case so hope you find this video informative and thank you for watching please comment your questions I will try to respond them and I will try to resolve your queries if I can.